مرحبا بكم كيف حالكم؟ أرجو أن تكونوا بخير I'm quite sure you understood everything without the translation, isn't it? See how far we have come in only a couple of lessons? By the way, don't forget to check our second channel. You will find all of these expressions posted there separately. The link is down below. Now let's get back to the matter at hand. As we already said, today we are going to finish the second half of the alphabet. We did stop last time at the letter BOD, so we should be starting from the letter BO. So without any further delay, هيّا نبدأ. As we already said, we are starting with the letter BO. BO. It has a big loop and a vertical line, and it has a heavy sound that fills the mouth. Next, keeping the same shape and adding a dot above the letter, this letter is called va, va. Try to pronounce it by starting with the tongue between front upper and front lower teeth. Let's move on with a small curve on the top and a big curve below the line. We do call this letter ain, ain. Try to block the throat a little bit at the beginning. It will help you. Keeping the same shape and adding a dot above. We do call this letter Rain. One more time. Rain. From the throat, try to do the Rain sound as when you gargle. The next letter is known as ف ف It's quite easy and please don't forget to follow the pattern Let's move on It looks similar to the previous one but the curve here is deeper and it goes below the line Not to mention that it has two dots We do call this letter قاف قاف. Next, this letter with a small sort of S on top of it is called Kaf. Kaf. Please always keep an eye on the pattern. Next on the list, we do find the letter Lam. Lam. And as you can see, it has a curve sitting below the line. This letter here is sitting partly below the line and it is known as meme. One more time. Meme. Please pay attention to the patterns. It's crucial. Let's move on. With a big curve underneath the line and a dot, this letter here is known as noon. Noon. Next, sitting partly below the line, this letter is known as WOW. WOW. This letter with two sorts of loops linked to each other is known as HA. HA. And it has a soft sound coming from the bottom of the throat. Please take a close look here. In fact, before moving to the next letter, we would like to draw your attention to this pattern. This is also the letter H. H. You can find it written this way on the alphabet. It looks like the letter O in English and it is written on the line. Just keep that in mind. The next letter is called Hamza. Hamza. And it is the letter that some teachers do not include in the alphabet. 
But as we already said in our second lesson, we have decided to go with 29 letters. If you are new, please watch the second lesson. Let's move on to the final letter of the alphabet. Sitting partly below the line with two dots underneath, our final letter is called Ya, Ya. That's it, you have made it. Before concluding, let's recapitulate. This time we are going to repeat the whole alphabet at one go. We will position each letter according to the line and while keeping the same order, we will put letters that look similar next to each other. Alif Ba Ta Tha Jim Ha Kha Dal Dal Ra Zai Sin Shin Sad Bad Ba Ba Ain Rain ف قاف كاف لام ميم نون واو ها همزة يا We are so proud of you. It's all thanks to you. You made it possible by giving it a try. And remember, every accomplishment starts with a decision to try. Shukran. See you next time. Ila al